What up, Raph Leaders? Welcome back to my channel. Today, I'm introducing season 12 <clears throat> of Raphael Nation Vlogs. This is six years, the beginning of the sixth year of vlogging on a regular basis. Started this channel in, you know, 2013, but only started regularly vlogging in about 2017, around 2017. So this is year number six and this is the beginning of season 12. A season lasts six months. So season 12 extends from July 2022 to December 2022. And what we can cover in season 12, we wanna talk about wealth management, wealth creation, generational wealth, and what do you do with all of this wealth? I have some very uh, unique ideas about how to build wealth and how to grow wealth. You'll see from my 21 companies that I'm working on that I have an entirely different view of how to run a company, how to build a company, how to start a company, right? So <clears throat> we're going to talk about the business models behind these 21 companies that I'm building. We're also going to talk about our national wealth. Right now, Guyana is on track to have a record year of economic growth north of 50%, just as I predicted, you know, three or four years ago that we're going to have years when the economy will double in size <clears throat> as, as long as as soon as the oil and gas industry comes on stream and we've actually seen that happen so far Guyana has earned 953 million US dollars from uh, the oil and gas industry and if you go to I'll place a link to it here if you go to the Bank of Guyana website you'll see there they have the current um, that is the quarter uh, Q2 that is the second quarter report for the the natural resource fund the sovereign wealth fund and the fund now contains 753 million US dollars this is after they withdrew 2 mil 200 million US dollars in Q2 in the second quarter uh, to spend on the country to spend on the economy so we're looking at a record growth. I predicted that the Sovereign Wealth Fund would hit a billion dollars by the first end of the first quarter of 2023. We're on track to do that even after they've withdrawn $200 million from the fund, right? Because the production rate has now increased to 340 uh, billion, 340,000 barrels per day, and that's going to give us two billion US dollars. In, in our um, sovereign wealth fund because our, of our 50% profit share and 2% royalty. So I'm going to explain the sovereign wealth fund. I'm going to explain during this uh, season how that money is uh, rolling in and why Guyana is bucking the trend that is hitting the rest of the world that is of uh, chaos and inflation all around the world. Ghana is on track to reverse that, especially if we let the value of the Ghana dollar rise, because we're going to see either deflation or stabilization in the value of commodities in Ghana if we let the value of the Ghana dollar rise. So we're going to talk about wealth and wealth fund in this season. And I'm going to introduce to you the companies that I'm building. The first company that I'm uh, going to introduce to you is uh, Raphael Nation, right? Raphael Nation Brands. It's built entirely on this uh, YouTube channel. Based on this YouTube channel, I created a website called Raffle Nation Brands, right? You can go, I'll put a link to it here. Uh, I'll put a link to it below in the description, rnbrand.online, where you can buy all things Guyanese. Today, I'm gonna go out and take a look at the uh, exposition, that is the uh, exhibition of Guyanese made products, products we made in Guyana. I'm going to put those products on my website. So in my next video, which is going to be in a few hours from now, I'll show you all of the local handicrafts and makers in Guyana manufacturing things, right? Ordinary people manufacturing things. And I'm going to let you select from that video what you want me to put on the website. And if you go right now to the website, I have over 1,200 items, over 1,200 items up on the website. Uh, that you can purchase and will be shipped to you anywhere in the world. Go log into the website. In other words, create an account, log into the website, browse the site, and eventually I'm going to put all of the products that you want to see uh, sold, that is, you want to buy 
from Guyana as I show you them on this channel, all of those products will be available on the website for you to buy. And I'm gonna use uh, Visa and MasterCard, American Express, and uh, PayPal as uh, payment, forms of payment that you can, that will accept on the website. But eventually I'm also gonna accept Bitcoin. So we're gonna talk about cryptocurrency, why I have not invested in cryptocurrency to this point, but why I will accept payment eventually in cryptocurrency. So this season we're gonna talk about wealth and wealth management if you are young, if you are, are uh, in Guyana or out of Guyana and you want to learn how to create wealth in this new economy, this new uh, environment around the world, we'll talk about how I do it and my views on how to do it. I don't believe in monopoly. I don't believe in, um, in being first to market and capturing uh, the market and, and, and rapid growth, which is what Silicon Valley pushes. You know, you want to load up the company with all this debt you get all these investors money and you try to rapidly scale up you you major on growth and then you try to capture the market uh, the largest market share and, and to eliminate the competition i don't believe that is a good strategy i believe in slow deliberate consistent growth i believe that you can compete with the biggest company out there if you are creative and innovative i don't agree with elon musk and i'm going to share with you in this season what are the things that I do not agree with about Elon Musk or Mark Zuckerberg or all these um, current crop of billionaires who've gotten to the way, where they are by simply capturing monopoly and eliminating competition. I believe that if you keep your company consistent and low uh, in terms of debt, debt free, right? So usually you can scale up growth if you, months, if you, if you amass a lot of debt, you know, and you, you burn a lot of money to get growth. But the alternative way of doing the same thing is to simply grow slowly and deliberately over, say, 10 years. You get to the same point. You do so more slowly, but you can do it consistently. So if there are downturns in the economy, your company does not collapse because you don't have all the pressure of, of, of bank loans and debt that you have to simply um, meet and that keeps driving uh, your work, right? That, that, that puts pressure on your company. So I'm showing you how you can do this without amassing a huge amount of debt to build a company. So that's what we're going to talk about in season two, sorry, season 12. We're going to talk about how to build wealth in the new economy and then how to spend that money. I'm going to talk about the national economy and I'm going to talk about your personal economy and how I do it in my companies. Share this video with friends and family around the world. Let people know what's happening here in Georgetown, Guyana. Later.